Hey, Mr. Gardeners, here we are again, out in the woods hiking with the McDonough students doing some environmental studies, and they found an interesting plant that they were intrigued with, and we found it. It's in bloom, has a little white flower on it, and they're learning new facts about it. So with me here is Grace. Grace, tell us about this. What plant did we find? Uh, it's called a May apple. May apple. How many leaves do we see? One. Two. Well, it has so, two, but it's as two. young, it's one. Yeah, when it's when it's young, they're just single. And then we have these rhizome-type uh, roots, much like the ginger that we looked at, underground stems that grow, and not one that's eaten by the deer, because why? It's poisonous. Poisonous. So, therefore, this is a good one for your garden, because it's not going to be uh, eaten by the ornery little deer in your yard. But the other problem is it doesn't like competition. So you have to have this kind of isolated from some other plants and it's not going to compete very well. So it's in full bloom now, little white flowers. We had a hard time finding them. Where, what month are we in here? May? May. May 19th today is. May 19th. So by the end of the month, actually in the next few days, all these flowers are gone, but a pretty, pretty little white petal. But what's it going to be followed by? What comes uh, next? An apple. So what do they look like? Do you remember how big do they get? They're apples. Pretty big. So inch and a half, little yeah. round balls. So come on over, you wanna take a look? We'll find one of these on our May apples. This is a plant that colonizes its zone three to eight in Maryland, also called the American mandrake. So look over here, here's a typical one in the woodland. And here's our fruit that's already developing. So can they eat this when it develops? Yes. Yeah, so they can eat these, but because the whole plant's poisonous, we don't recommend that you do that. It's a poisonous plant. The only part of it that is not poisonous is the fruit itself, but you have to know the proper time to eat these, and it's not until August, so we don't recommend that. But it's a good perennial for your gardens. Comes up every year, will colonize, short-lived flower, and unless you're really looking for it, you're never going to find that flower. And there's your, um, what is it, palmately veined leaf on it, very decorative. What are these, about 12 inches, 12 inches tall. So there you go, Master Gardeners. We're enjoying our hike in the woods.